Accused shoplifter is shot and killed at a Hollywood Walgreens, and now his family wants answers. CBS 2's Leslie Marin is live outside the store at Sunset and Vine, which is expected to reopen today. Good morning, Leslie. Good morning, Peter. It's not open just yet. You can see there is caution tape right at the door of this Walgreens. Uh, but there is a sign here telling customers that they will reopen at 8 a.m. There are just still so many questions in this investigation. And the family of the man shot demanding answers as the security guard, excuse me, is not facing charges. Now, this is cell phone video moments after the shooting. It is too graphic to show you the full thing, but we have blurred some of the images. You can see a security guard is leaning over the body of the man shot. And this morning, family is identifying the man as 21 year old Jonathan Hart. Friends called him Sky. Police say Hart was shoplifting when the security guard came up to him and an argument started. A man who was with Hart explains what happened next. He saw him, the security guard reaching and then he just uh, shot him. Yes, and he had a taser too. I don't know why he used, didn't use his taser. Well, Hart was shot in the upper body, according to police. Police have released limited details on why the guard was carrying a gun, but is is not uncommon for security guards to be armed if they are properly licensed by the state. Hart's family says they will hold a vigil outside the Walgreens at 4 p.m. They say that Hart had been living on the street for about a year, but had just started counseling foster kids. Reporting live in Hollywood, Leslie Marines.